my dear students very good evening to all welcome back to my channel today i am going to uh, show the some of the gunshot and important questions and answers for the final examinations for the telangana state for all inter vocational first year students in english medium okay so let we see the one by one general foundation course common for all inter vocational first years let we see the one by one two mass questions define child labor so this is a very very important question whatever i am giving so many questions are there but i will give some of the questions if you will go through that whatever i am giving if you will go through that important question definitely uh, you will pass if you are the like a average definitely you may go for the above average okay like if you are uh, like a slow learner you can you may get the average marks if you are uh, good students definitely you will get the 55 50 marks also okay so let we see the one by which defend child labor okay so here the mainly deprives children of their childhood their potential and their dignity and that is harmful to physical and mental development especially it's refers to the the work key that is mentally physically socially or moral dangerous and harmful to children okay so below 18 years if they will go for the any work it may be the work it may leads to mental physical stress so that is the reason so it is called has a child labor so labor is nothing but the, so we have to do the so much of work okay to earn the money so actually like above 18 years is there is no problem they they may have the physical mental maturity will be there okay but here below 16 years or below 18 years they may not have the that much physical mental stability mental maturity so that is the reason if you will they will go for the so those people also they will uh, like a legally so they will also punishable okay so here the mentally physically socially are more morally dangerous and harmful to children okay actually so a child they needs schooling they need love and affection from the parents so so many things will be there so here instead of going for the school if they will go for the labor work so definitely it is a very dangerous to the people it may be physically hey, like a, it will affect their mentally it will affect okay so next coming to the according to, they have given two definitions so first one is this one second one is ilo ilo means international labor organizations what is meant by drug abuse substance abuse or chemical abuse so abuse is nothing but the frequent use of a drug continuously if you are using without this drug we are uh, unable to stable okay frequent use of a drug it causes the physical or mental harm okay it leads to impair social abilities okay drugs are it may be like a painkillers so that is the reason so we have to avoid the, this one so next coming to the what is public health so public health is nothing but the it is a uh, state of complete physical mental social well being not merely in the absence of disease so here the the sign the public health is a science of protecting improving the health of the families as well as the communities through the promotion of healthy lifestyles research for disease and injury so different different etc etc will be there so is a overall the public health is nothing but the protecting and preventing the uh, prevention of illness uh, protecting and maintaining the health this all comes under public health okay next coming to the what is meant by swachh bharat abhiyan okay is the mainly it is a, like a clean india mission okay it is one of the campaign so the main aim of this swachh bharat abhiyan uh, to clean up the streets and roads and infrastructure of the indian cities smaller towns and rural areas the main swachh bharat swachh means clean bharat means india abhiyan means they are giving like assurance like and all okay so here the main purpose of this swachh bharat abhiyan is to clean up the streets roads infrastructure of the india's towns or cities or rural areas and all okay next coming to the what is okay next one is the what is child marriage or early marriage if the child is marriage as a, it's a one of the formal marriage or informal union before the age of 18 years if the child is go for the marriage before the age of 18 years it is called as a child marriage okay 
so mostly this child marriage is forced marriages okay next coming to the here one more definition will be there according to the indian law marriages if they will marry before below the age of 21 years of the men okay below the age of 18 years for the women so next coming to gender equality so gender equality is a human right everybody has to get the free education equally they have to get the free 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 and all so that is the reason so gender equality is a human right so it is achieved when women and men enjoy the same rights and opportunities across all the sectors of the society including economic participation decision making where aspiration and needs of the women and men are equally valued and favored okay so this is a one next what is goal setting okay okay powerful process for thinking about an ideal future okay so uh, setting means systematically so is a systematic process will be there it's a one of the powerful process okay we we have the goal so without doing hard work we may not get we, we may we may not achieve the goal so it's a that is the reason we are calling as a powerful process for thinking about an ideal future okay next one is what is time management so here the refers to the managing time effectively so that the right time is allocated to the right activity getting the things done by others without our wasting our time we have to manage okay in the effective way at the right time okay next one is what is meant by traffic sense just i am not explaining just i will list out all the important questions defend human rights also important what is corruption what is communal harmony also what is national integration defend demonetization next to define poverty two definitions three definitions they are given according to your feasibility you can write it next what is unemployment list all the causes of the unemployment write about the right bima patakam okay what uh, right about the asura pension scheme what is meant by panchayat raj what is or uh, define afforestation a forest station is the establishment of a forest a stand up a tree scenario where there was no forest what is vermicompost what are the advantages of the solar energy what is rural development define nabard what is outreach what is rural poverty what is entrepreneurship what is entrepreneur define value what is attitude here two definitions are there you can go for the two what is motivation here also two definitions are there motivation is nothing but it's one of the desire to learning 
what is meant by leadership this is also important question what is meant by woman empowerment woman empowerment is nothing but the strengthening the capacity of the woman write about the concept of make in india write briefly about the startups what is computer write any two input and output devices what is hardware what is meant by software what is meant by internet what is meant by digitalization what is operating system or system software what is application software so so whatever i am listing all the important questions so those are the 100% final it may come so you have to do the hard work definitely you will get the good marks thank you all i hope you people will get the some of the knowledge regarding which one is better which one is good how to okay everything a little bit i'm explaining okay thank you all for watching my channel have a nice day all the best bye bye see you in next video